What's up everybody? How you doing? The fuck's going on? Snow Joe Coward coming at you yet again from Phnom Penh, Cambodia. I just want to show you something real fast. I'm at the I'm at the coffee corner here in Phnom Penh. This place makes some nasty coffee. Their coffee is not good. It's not, well, it sounded British. It's not, it's not good. It's not good. Now, my favorite place I always go to, Le Irresistible, they're closed on Monday, so that means I have to come to this fucking shitty ass place. Let me show you what, what, what these people gave me and what they consider to be espresso. Now, if you look, you see, you see on the edges there, that, now that is a tell, a tell, telltale sign that it's of low quality. It almost looks like a cup of tea. It's not black, it's not, uh, it's not opaque, if you will. It's translucent on the edges there. Are you impressed with my vocabulary? Yeah, no joke actually can read and write. Yeah, go fuck yourself for all you dumbass people who think I'm such an asshole, all right? I, I'm actually pretty goddamn smart. Um, I mean, look, I have glasses. But you're thinking, no joke, shut the fuck up and read the goddamn email. Okay, guys, sorry. I just, I just don't like it when people make shitty coffee and then overcharge. Okay, so this is a no joke Q&A segment and I have an email from a guy. And the title of it is, let me pull this up. The title of it is, best full body exercise. That's the best full body exercise. It says, <laughs> it says, what the fuck's going on, man? Nice, nice, dude. The fuck's going on? This is Derek coming at you live from Zebulon, Georgia. Derek, that's awesome, dude. See, everybody, it's rubbing off. The douchebagginess of No Joke is, is international, everybody. From Zebulon, Georgia. Uh, you're, uh, you're a dick, but I love it, man. You like dick. That's nice. Too many people are so politically correct nowadays, and that's why I like you, man. Well, I like you too, Derek. You're my favorite redneck piece of shit from Georgia, all right? Uh, do you have all your teeth? Probably not. Anyways, no joke, I'm a busy man. I have five kids, work two jobs, damn. Five kids and two jobs, man, what the, f the fuck were you thinking, dude? Dumbass. I barely get to sleep, yeah, I bet. My question is, if I could do just one exercise three times a week for a full body workout, what would you say? I'm not looking for cardio as much as strength. Okay. You look like a fit dude. Yeah, you're goddamn right I'm fit. I'm a sexy bitch, man. All right, all right. I'm, I'm, I'm what they call an Adonis. I'm a fucking Adonis. And a douchebag. Um, you look like a fit dude, so I thought I'd ask you. Um, I don't have the time to do CrossFit or box. Now, oh, Derek, now when you say CrossFit or box, when you say box, I, I sincerely hope you're not referring to a CrossFit gym as a box. Alright? Now, a lot of people do, and that's fine. That's fine. But, dude, it's a fucking gym. A box is a piece of cardboard that you fold into a cube, you put all your shit in there, and then you you take it from your current house to another house. That's what a fucking box is. Or it's a pussy. Okay? Uh, vagina. Excuse me. Um, but I think he's talking about boxing, you know, like like fighting, because cause he knows that I like to box and all. Uh, keep putting out good shit and give a shout out to Georgia. Take it easy, brother. Yeah, man. Shout out to Georgia. I lived in Atlanta, Georgia for about a year, um, and I loved it. I, I think Georgia's a, a beautiful place. Um, shout out to Georgia. Shout out to, to the dirty, dirty South. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to all the fucking uh, corn-fed trailer trash pieces of shit out there like you are, Derek. And shout out to all my uh, my, my African-American friends in Georgia because they make up the, uh, the majority of the state's population. Now, you know I'm kidding. I'm, t I'm, I'm talking about black people. Anyways, yeah, so Derek, uh, your, your, your question was the best, full body, the best full body workout that you could do three times a week for, you know, I guess, you, you know, you'll, you're, you're, you're a little tight on time. Um, I mean, the, 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 the first thing that comes to mind when I, when I think of an exercise that works the most muscles at once, I mean, just, we're, we're talking one exercise. 
Um, I would say, I would say the deadlift, man. I mean, that that really targets more of your posterior chain. And for those of you who who don't know what posterior means, it means the back of your body. So like from the back of your neck all the way down uh, your back, down your your glutes, your little glutes, your hamstrings, your calves, all the way to your heels. That, that, that's your posterior chain. The, the front is your anterior. Um, anyways, you're thinking no joke. Just shut the fuck up. Stop, stop, stop trying to sound smart and just answer the fucking question. Oh, sorry, dude. Okay, the deadlift, man. I mean, ha hands down. The deadlift is great because you can... It, it's, it, it's the heaviest amount of weight that you can lift. Um... You don't need a rack, like you don't need a barbell rack or anything, you just have it on the ground. And it's 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 what's like a primal lift. There, there's, there's things called primal lifts, and I believe that the deadlifts and squats are one of them. Because think about the deadlift, man. It, it's like it's like a very primitive position. You sit you you excuse me, you sit in a in a in a like a squatted position. Like you're about to pick something up off the ground. So it's almost like you're ripping a fucking tree out of the earth which is pretty badass. And then you just stand up, you roll your shoulders back, and it's it's really good, it, it builds up your traps, it builds up your, your lats, your, your back muscles, like your rhomboids. Um, this is, yeah, rhomboids, right? Uh, your lower back, um, that is called the, uh, the erector spinae, I, I believe. Uh, some of you, some of you, uh, you know, I don't know, crossfitters, out there some of you uh, phys physiological experts out there can correct me on that but I believe it's called the erector spinae whatever dude it's, it's your fucking lower back all right I don't give a fuck it gets your glutes gets you really gets your hamstrings good and your quads your calves I don't know about your calves maybe a little bit probably not enough to get noticeable results and it for sure tightens up your your, your abdominals because you have to have strong abs to lift on a heavy deadlift and it also builds up your arms. It'll build up your forearm strength. Your, it'll build up your grip strength. Um, it'll build, probably help your biceps a little bit. So, I mean, I'd have to say the deadlift, man. And, dude, if you can, I think you should incorporate one more exercise into your routine. I would say if you don't have a dip bar, either get a dip bar or do push-ups. I would say do the deadlift and push-ups. Maybe, like... Maybe do like five sets of five deadlifts or whatever, like the five by five method, and then maybe go for 100 push-ups. I don't know, three days a week. I mean, look, I'm not a fucking expert. I'm not your damn trainer, okay? But I'm giving you some advice. If, if, if you're gonna do an exercise that, that targets the posterior chain of your body, you should even it out with one that gets the anterior chain of your body, such as a push-up, a dip, um, you know, maybe some, maybe some ab work. But I don't really know what the hell else to say to you, man. Uh, get, get back to your job, I guess. Get back to your five goddamn kids. Um, yeah, man, so the deadlift and some push-ups would be the best. All right, man, I hope I answered your question. If anybody else has any questions about health and fitness, martial arts, how to deal with people, uh, trolls on fucking Facebook, um, travel, living in Cambodia, whatever, man, drugs, um, dude. I'm your fucking guy, all right? I, I encompass all aspects of what this is, okay? Yeah, I'm a douchebag. Yeah, I'm an asshole. But the people that really think I'm a dick and can't stand me are the people that know that what I'm saying is the fucking truth. And you bitches just can't handle the dude who's, who's real. You can't handle my realness, man. Anyways, I hope I'm not talking too much shit. But uh, everybody, go fuck yourself. Subscribe to my goddamn channel, No Joe Coward. And uh, I will keep making the most badass videos on YouTube, hands down. All right, guys. Peace.